Hey everybody and welcome to this Dactronics video tutorial. My name is Brian Perry. I'm the event producer here at Iowa State University. And I'm going to take you through a process of switching from your primary system to your backup system in case something were to happen to your primary machine during an event. Now the equipment you see here may differ from your site since everything gets custom installed, but the steps are still the same. So let's take a look. To start, let's take a look at how a primary and backup system works. Whenever content is either created in Content Studio or brought in on an external drive, it is always saved onto your primary digital media players. A program called SyncBack is scheduled to run automatically on the backup players to check for any new and updated content on the primary player and then it is copied to the backup. Your buttons in Display Studio play the content to both the primary and backup machines, so at any point what is playing on the primary is also what is playing on the backup. If you have a DMP7000, this will automatically happen. But if you have a DMP8000, you will need to make sure and check the zones on both the primary and backup on step number two of your scripting buttons to make content play to both machines. For a system that is equipped with a backup, there is a backup player as well as a backup video processor. The primary and backup run independently and are selected using an AB switch. First, let's locate the AB switch inside your rack. Your system may be equipped with an Extron model. For Extron switches, number one is the primary and number two is the backup. In this case, A is the primary and B is the backup. For Extron switches, if you see a three and a four, those options are not used and will produce a blank display if accidentally selected. Push the number two button to switch to the backup system. So now your display should be running on its backup system. Now make sure to check this backup system before every event. For DMP 7000 driven systems, you need to switch the imaging services inside Display Studio to point to the backup system. This will change what the monitor wall looks at and allows you to make new buttons with the primary machine off. So in your main menu, go to Properties, then service configuration and now check the box next to the backup DMP 7000 player name then click OK. This concludes the tutorial for switching from primary to your backup system. Continue to other videos to learn more about your Dactronics control system.